Thanks for watching NFL Daily here at Chat Sports. Today's show is brought to you by My TV Choice app. Download today at MyTVChoice.com. On Monday's show, Tom and I took a bunch of questions on NFL Daily. Here are our favorites around the Detroit Lions. Right, from Zach, will the Lions give up on Matt Stafford soon? I hope. You keep saying that. He stinks. Uh, let me put it this way. I currently have a bet with James here, Chat Sports, uh, of I, th I think it was a 24 pack, and then he doubled down, so it's a 48 pack of beer that Matt Stafford is on the, the Lions. I don't think I'm going to double down again and wait till 2020. I think I'm, I'm, I'm just going to cash out now. So it's not going to happen this year, but I could see it next offseason. See, if you were a real pal, you would double down. Use those beers for my 84 beers in six minutes challenge. I mean, look, look, I, I got 48. I don't care if it's if it's Natty Light. I'm set for at least a day. <laughs> <laughs> Will the Lions target a quarterback in this draft? Yes, but it might not be an early round quarterback. The Lions' general MO, no and this is Bob Quinn's MO, is they want to take a quarterback. And it's not the worst. In fact, it's actually pretty good logic. If you're in round five, round six, round seven, you'd rather get lucky, because that's what happens in those rounds, get lucky on a quarterback than get lucky on a defensive lineman. Because the value's so outlandishly in favor of, of QB. Yeah. I mean, if you find a Jacoby Brissett somehow in those middle rounds, which I know it's a bit earlier than, than the mid rounds I mentioned, but if you find that value, or if you even just get an A.J. McCarron. Yep. If the Browns hadn't botched it, they would have got a mid-round pick back for him. And to Fair. find that type of valuable backup <sighs> makes some sense. I I guess I don't I I just think if granted you're the, it's not a great quarterback class. Yeah, that's that's my only real issue. All right, real Jacob, you look like a Lions fan. Will the Lions draft Dwayne Haskins? I'm gonna say no. I would be stunned if they went quarterback. That that would be probably like the biggest kind of see the logic behind it surprise. Beyond just like something totally off the rails, like I mean, the Seahawks going Rashad Penny. If you're the Lions, you got to say, all right, how can I possibly compete with the Packers still have Aaron Rodgers, right? So as long as they still have Aaron Rodgers, I understand they only had five wins last year. They're going to compete. The Bears, you could argue, one of the best teams in the NFL. They had 12 wins last year. And I can would expect the Vikings to be better. If the Lions want to actually compete, you don't go out and draft Dwayne Haskins. And you know how no, much I hate Matt. And, and all of their moves so far have been, we're going to win right now with exactly. our current regime. Because especially if you're if you're Bob Quinn and, and, and you're and you're Matt Patricia, you draft a quarterback. You're kind of like, well, we're gonna punt the next year and a half. <laughs> Do you have the job security? Probably not. Probably not. Do you think the Lions will look at Tyree Jackson? If you guys want a raw developmental type quarterback, Tyree Jackson's your guy. So I think it makes sense for Detroit there. See, I think Tyree Jackson is a fun prospect. God, I hope he doesn't go to the Lions. You don't you don't believe in them to actually. To There's how many it? how many great players leave or retire from the NFL early because they're with the Lions. Okay, Barry Sanders and Calvin Johnson, that's it. And it was body for Calvin. I don't know. All right, you just hate Detroit. All right, from Mr. Sports, Lions let Bob Quinn go if they don't do anything this year. I, I don't think so, but at the same time, Bob Quinn's hire was Matt Patricia. I, I feel like they're uh, almost tied on the hip here. They're not going to do anything this year. What will the Lions do? Be around 500 like they always are. Th that's great. Just saying. That means nothing.